Hi everyone, it's JJ here and welcome or welcome back to Be Colorful. I decided to continue to offer you some small ideas to use the Tonic Craft Kit 54, this time opting for much quick and easy cards than those seen in the previous video and also to be able to make the most of the small stamps and dies of the kit. So let's get started making this quick and easy card number 7 for this kit. I plan to use the aqua flow pen included in the kit, so for my background panel I gonna use watercolor paper, especially because it has a beautiful texture. I'm going to die cut the panel with a stitch rectangle die. Next, in the center of the panel, I'm going to stamp one of the pot from the kit with my VersaFine Onyx Black Ink. Then I stamp the plant always with one of the stamps included in the kit. And I'm going to heat embossing uh, the stamp with a clear embossing powder. Thanks uh, to the embossing, the stamps uh, are now waterproof. So I'm going to add a touch of uh, watercolor with the aqua flow pen that I find in the kit. You can use uh, any color you like uh, and any type of watercolor. I'm gonna spray a few drops of the same color because I think uh, the splashes uh, looks great on a watercolor project. And here we go! A really very simple thing, but I really love this delicate watercolor effect. I'm going to stamp the Hello Sentiment included in the kit and emboss it. The card is almost finished but uh, I decided uh, to add uh, some twine. I glue the panel on the card base a standard card that's four and a quarter by five and a half uh, inches with some foam tape to give the card a little bit of dimension. As a finishing touches, I'm going to create a few drops with a copper crystal drops. The video ends here. A quick and easy card, but I love the watercolor stains. They have something poetic. I hope you like this idea and if so leave me a thumbs up, a comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much and I see you in the next video. Bye bye and be colorful!